Hey guys, coming to you today with a failed Easter video that I'm going to use alternatively to highlight the importance of dialing in your beans because I guess I got a bit overconfident with these beans that my sister brought back from, I think, Chile um, and thought, I can't be bothered dialing in these beans because I've got a stepless grinder, which I've mentioned before, means that it doesn't actually have like knobs or indicators on the dial that are fixed. It kind of can turn as many times as you want in any which direction. Um, so it can be quite tricky to then dial in a new bag of beans and then undial that back to what your normal consistent beans are. Um, and I guess dialing in is a concept that most people that are probably operating on one of at least these machines or higher, or even with some of the Breville or Sage equivalents um, at that level are doing. And so dialing in is really important for every type of bean and every bag of bean even that you get. I find that I'm quite lucky in that the beans that I consistently have are reliable from one bag to the next. I don't need to worry too much about redialing them in with a new bag. But this is what happens if you don't dial in your beans. So see, this is the new bag of beans that I was trying for this video. And it this is it at one time speed. Look at how quickly the shot is being pulled into this cup. It's just too fast. So you can tell this was wrong for a lot of reasons. There was no real pre-infusion time. It was um, too quick. So it probably went for about 10 to 15 seconds instead of that 25 to 27 second range. You could also see on the pressure gauge that it was only about four bar, so not high enough. So I will do a proper video on dialing in beans, which uh, there's plenty of videos out there. There's plenty of resources, but I guess if you're looking for Pippa resources, I'll put it up here. But what I would hazard a guess went wrong with the new bag of beans compared to my normal bag or what I what I would do if I went to dial in those beans would be I'd look at whether or not I had the right amount of beans. So I've been using 23 grams with this standard beans that I've been buying for at least the past year. Um, maybe I needed more. Maybe I didn't have enough tamping pressure. Um, maybe I needed to grind it a little bit finer. So adjust the settings on the grind grinder um, and see if that got me a bit of a better outcome from dialing in. So that's what I presume was probably a bit off. It, it absolutely could have been the volume. It could have been the fineness or coarseness of the grind. It could have been a combination of both. I might not have used my WDT as well. It, there could be multiple factors, but if I was looking at dialing it, dialing it in properly, that's how I would approach it um, with this bag. But I will do a proper video on how I figured out how to dial in my beans and look at how much better this is.